Hi friends, it's me Kunal from Bing Commerce. So guys, in today's video, we will talk about one amazing and short, interesting, simple, sweet topic that is DMARC. So in today's video, we will talk about what is DMARC and how you can set up DMARC. So guys, before we proceed further, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please subscribe it and also click the bell icon so that you get notified every time whenever we upload a new video. So guys, now let's understand the full form of DMARC. So DMARC means Domain Based Message Authentication Reporting and Conformance. Now guys, if we talk about DMARC in a very simple and easy way, as you all know, I don't teach complicated stuff. So in simple, DMARC means Additional Security over SPF and DKIM. So guys, DMARC is a extra shield that protects SPF and DKIF. Now you might be wondering, hey brother, can you explain SPF? So guys, yes, I have made one amazing, simple, sweet, dedicated video especially for SPF. You can click on the card and I have also put link in description box. So this is my SPF video guys, 4 minutes video and I have teach everything in a very simple and easy language. If you also want to know what is DKIM, I have also made one video. You can click on card and I have also put one video in description box. You can also see I have made a video on DKIM. Okay, very simple, sweet and easy video. Let's explain you everything in a very easy way. Okay, so now guys, after you will see those two videos, you can easily understand what is SPF and DKIM. So now guys, let me give you one simple and sweet scenario. So now guys, there's one email sender and one is email receiver. As you all know, in email marketing, email sender is the person who sends email and email receiver is the person who receives email. He or she can be customer, client or anyone. So guys, suppose email sender has sent one email. So guys, for some reason, your SPF and DCAM is not working and has not verified this email message. So that can be a very dangerous thing for email receivers. So DMARC comes in action and what DMARC do? It prevents this situation to happen. What DMARC do? DMARC immediately rejects or report emails to get delivered if it is not verified by SPF and DKIM. So guys, suppose this is the case and if for some reason SPF and DKIM haven't able to verify this email that DMARC will stop or reject or report this email before it delivers to email receiver so idea is that simple now we will talk about how you can set up dmark so guys it is very simple procedure you need to go to easydmark.com okay then you will visit to this website and here you have to simply click on platform now guys here you will see one tool option just click here and here you will find word dmark record generator just simply click here now guys you will come to this page so now guys here you have to fill this information okay it will ask for a policy type you have to put policy type as reject here it will ask for aggregate reporting that means where you want to get your reports okay so suppose for some reason your SPF and DCAM haven't verified so this DMARC will going to send you one message about this problem okay so I have written my support email you can write yours and here you have to put subdomain policy type as reject there are lots of complicated things like spf identifier alignment dkim alignment alignment report intervals percentage apply to so guys these are the very complicated stuff which involves lots of things so it is not possible for me to explain these things right now okay you can follow my email marketing tutorials just click on iCard, there you will find lots of email marketing videos. There I have taught each and everything in detail. So you simply have to select relax, relaxed, and put the reporting interval as 86,400 and percentage apply to 100. Also, you write the same email which you have written here. Okay, then just simply click on generate DMARC record. Okay, so now guys, here we have come with one problem. No problem, guys, you simply have to add here mail to hash and then write your email you can also write here as well okay so idea is that simple now click on generate demand record so now guys you can see status is successful you simply have to copy so now guys after you will copy the link you simply have to go to your 
domain name provider so, so in my case i have purchased my domain from godaddy so i will go to my domains area select the domain where you want to put the demand so suppose i put i want to put here so i will click the dns of that domain so guys here it will show lots of records so here you have to click on add just type txt here and put host as underscore dmark done and here you have to put the value which you have copied from here okay so i guess that's simple after you will do that just simply click on save so now guys this is what about setting up dmark so it is that simple okay so now guys we have understood what is dmark and how you can set up dmark so guys this is all about today's video if you want more things about email marketing like how to set up your own SMTP server, how to install email marketing automation system for free. You can watch all my email marketing tutorials. I have put the link in card as well as in description box. So guys, this is all for today's video. Bye bye.